A warm welcome to the training videos from Mady Orthopedics. The following film will give you helpful hints on patient care with the Mady M4S Comfort Knee Brace. The M4S Comfort is mainly used for ligamentous injuries in the knee joint. The knee brace ensures the necessary stability after surgery and during conservative treatment, especially in association with cruciate ligament ruptures. The sophisticated frame system ensures optimum stabilization of the knee joint based on the four-point principle, that is, after rupture of the anterior cruciate ligament. Furthermore, the physio-glide joint imitates the rolling gliding movement of the knee joint to guarantee that the orthosis fits perfectly. The additional option of limiting extension and flexion protects the affected knee joint from damaging movements and thus maintains the patient's treatment status. The orthosis should be worn directly next to the skin to ensure the best possible fit. Make sure that all the straps are open. To prevent incorrect fastening of the Velcro straps, it's recommended to close them again afterwards. It's best if the patient sits on the edge of a chair. Pull the orthosis over the leg and bend the knee to 45 degrees. Position the orthosis so that the middles of the hinges are at the level of the superior border of the kneecap. Make sure that the orthosis is not twisted on the leg. The straps should be secured in the order specified by the numbers to guarantee the orthosis fits securely and has the optimum effect. Start with straps 1 and 2. The knee should stay bent. Now push both orthosis hinges backwards towards the back of the leg. Make sure that the hinges are positioned behind the lateral medial midline of the leg. Now fasten straps 3, 4, 5 and 6. Please note that the pads on strap number 4 are split. These can be positioned around the scar if needed, in order to avoid unnecessary pressure on a possible surgical scar. It is now recommended to walk a few steps and check again that the orthosis fits properly. As you can see, the middle of the orthosis hinge should be positioned at the level of the superior border of the kneecap and behind the lateral medial midline of the leg. Then, pull the straps tight again in the same order to prevent the orthosis slipping. If the orthosis does slip, please check that the orthosis hinge is correctly positioned at the level of the superior border of the kneecap. Check the position of the calf strap number 5. This should cross above the widest part of the calf muscle. Add padding to the inner surfaces of the knee hinges using the extra padding supplied with the orthosis. Wear the orthosis directly next to the skin whenever possible. The inner pads and condyle pads can be washed by hand in cold water and a mild soap solution. Leave them to dry in the air. Matey, I feel better.